Welcome to case studies and in this specific section, once that you learned how to run a simulation, how to set up the physical property environment, the simulation environment, how to connect the units, add the input data and run, get the results, now it's time to work as an engineer. What if scenarios? What will happen if you change this? Or what will happen if there is a change in another plant and what happens to my process? And we were going to be working four main case, case scenarios. Case A is going to be changing the temperature of the heater. What happens if we change, for instance, from 15 Celsius to 30 Celsius? What is the change? What do you want to see regarding that? First, before doing anything, try to imagine what happens and then go to the simulation and let's verify. Then we have what, what is the change uh, if we have this change in pressure in the valve? what will happen if we depressurize or increase the pressure we don't drop the pressure that much try to guess what's going to happen with the following unit operations then what will happen with the reactor if we change uh, the total amount of air or if you were to change the from adiabatic to isothermal i mean i know that it, it sometimes it doesn't has this like logical sense but try to imagine what will happen with the simulation and with the following streams and unit operations. Then last case study will be what happens if we add more stages or if we change the reflux ratio of the distillation column. And I really think the distillation columns in real life have a lot of things that could be done in order to improve them. But because previous engineers have been working through it, there is this like status quo in which the column is working like that because someone else done it or has done it that way. So that's the way we work through this. But with the simulation, you have the tools to say the senior engineer or to the manager that yes, in fact, we are losing that amount of heat or that amount of process of the purity cool increase and so on. So guys, once again, let's check it out. Let's go and see those four case scenarios. 